what I was saying is that I should be in the dictionary next to the president who said copyrights are important when I successfully kept the sheriffs who were beating me up from destroying design specialties copyright spoon. And that's all I had basically in the jail. I didn't have much else. And did you know, if I had left, if I had grabbed anything else, when the sheriff said, grab your stuff, we're moving, if I had grabbed anything that was mine, I would have had to lose it somewhere as we were going to the door. Good thing, the only thing I took out of that cell was my razor, my triple blade razor. That They didn't give you a razor for damn good reason, and my razor was hard to use, I hadn't quite perfected it, but it did work. It, you can pull and push it in three different directions and it will snap the hair where you cut it. You can't do all the hair. And you know what? The hair on my right side of the face is a lot harder for me to control where it's going with the razor and which way I'm pulling. If it's on the left-handed side of my face, I can gauge where which way to pull it, but it's harder for me to squeeze it shut. The triple blade razor, I have to squeeze it shut and pull. So I had difficulty on both sides for different reasons. But that was the only thing I got. That's the only thing I gave them when I left and they took me out and they gave me a new shirt and armed me. They disarmed me by putting the shirt over my arms so I was not armed walking out of the jail to go to uh, out, out, book, out, exit, booking out. And uh, so there was nothing of mine in the cell. I had played, they made me, I don't know how I would have saved anything. Like, they don't let you take notes, just like now, you can't take notes. Like, do I think even a note phone would be cool? That Samsung that out, is that AT&T store? I don't, I don't know if it's a note or not. It's not what I'm buying, is the note. And that's not what's for sale at the AT&T store. So I don't know why I'm being ragged still for notes. I never wanted a note. I still don't want a note. Samsung is doing a better job with whatever they're selling than the note. They got basically three phones at the store. They got the new iPhone 12, the large one. I don't know who wants the skinny one. If you get an iPhone, you have so much responsibility to do something on an iPhone. Like whoever gets the skinny small one of an iPhone, you are asking for a, for other people to make up a lot of slack for you for buying the little mini iPhone 12. Like the only mini people that need a mini iPhone 12, I guess or what that woman said is that boy's had an uh, iPhone since he was 10. If you get an iPhone when you're 10, that's other people do need it. I, it's like 300 people give some sort of responsibility to a child. Yes, 300 people, 350 maybe, to have to give responsibility to one child and to lend a hand for at least one child. How am I in Joey's territory and, and Josh's territory? I might be one of their 300. We, I'm very happy about that. Who am I really involved with? I'm still really involved with Nikki, and I think she's telling me to shut up. But, I am waiting for an opportunity to write another email. I guess a lot, I made a lot of people tired with 50 pounds. Like, they're imagining filling up their car with 50 pounds. <laughs> yeah, that's tough. I'm just going to fill up my car every email he does. Maybe I should let them use some gas for a while. <laughs> How much does this weigh? My basket, that doesn't weigh 50 pounds. Like, lifting up the edge of my sofa, if I just lift my sofa, I could call that 50 pounds. 
Like, I'm not asking you to read it more and more. Maybe the first one... Man, my writing is not on kilter. I have better writing. Okay, that is 50 pounds. I mean, a 45 is not that hard to lift. Like this, this Safeway 50 pounds, this Safeway is a lot. Okay, well there's 45 pounds. It's more than that. It's way more than that. That thing weighs like 90 pounds. And did, 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 I'll tell you this, did, I think it's Worthington's, worth, it was Worthington, as a matter of the fact, in somebody else's outfit, because, no, it, no, it was a nice guy. You know who it was? It was a guy who heard River Flavin, River Flavin, I said River Flavin, before I said the whole thing. River Flavin, ah. It was a guy who heard about my story saying River Flavin, who took me out to see my lawyer. So some of the stories do get around, because I was definitely eyeballed, serious eyeball attention for me walking outside this jail. Well, I got all eyeballs walking outside of jail. <laughs> all eyeballs. <laughs> From senior 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 <laughs> was very senior. Ah, uh, even the grand station of we know you can get to here. Can you pass us all? And I did. If I man, I need those police tapes. You need to hear the police tapes because those are good. I mean, I swear those police tapes. You wouldn't expect them from the incoming, uh, incoming photo I had. Because my photo is like, I can't believe you're putting me out and you're getting me in here. I mean, I thought there was a way out. Until you take the picture, I wasn't necessarily in jail. But as soon as my picture was taken, I actually went to jail. <laughs> I thought they were going to cry cut at some point. Like, they were playing Silly Billy for a long time. I didn't know what was going on. I was still in pain. Like, I was supposed to get out of pain. You know, usually, I didn't mention that I was in pain. I did, to some people. I don't know, those cuffs hurt. I'm glad my wrist is better. I mean, I did, you know, the the MacArthur thing on my wrist that I thought is gone. So they, it's completely ground off, knock, knocked the head out of it. It's gone. Well, it's not quite gone. But if I get real skinny, I don't know, it's right there. And maybe I should get a tattoo around that bone, say, Watch it there. I mean, I need a little X right where that bone is and say, try not to get a handcuff right there. I mean, my thumb is really sensitive. Just by touching this MacArthur thing, I mean, it hurts when somebody put cuffs right here. I don't know, I have a whole vein going to my thumb, my huge damn thumb that really, I use both hands, this is about, I'm clicking in on how many times I use the button, and the left hand uses the space bar a lot, and when you hurt my space bar that fucking much, I mean, you hit my space, you really hurt my space bar, I mean, you're, you're missing my approach to the space bar every time. Like, I don't know who's flying the word cabin to miss the space bar, but it's it's really annoying. I definitely need somebody else to fly my space bar somewhere else. And I don't know how long I'm going to let this recording go. I mean, I started with 
being in jail and being outside of jail. Like I told a few people, don't act in jail like what you're going to act like out of jail. Because I believe they don't let offices or truths be heard in jail. Oh, I'm trying to put this piece of tape around the center of my body. This duct tape, and it's holding pretty good. It's supposed to let my body not fall out of form. But it gets stuck in place pretty good. So I'm thinking, like I had 16 years outside of the country, and people are saying that 16 years that anybody left the country for is worth a lot of money on my on my account for having left the country. Like who made that much sense? Like here's Dr. Amen, and the way I should have written my thesis. And you're telling me a bank was cooperative from you because you read my thesis. So cooperative, in fact, in the United States that I still, I don't even know how low you can fucking go to say you read part of my thesis, understood it, explained it in layman's terms. That I've already explained in layman's terms, pretty much layman's terms. As good as I good with you knocked the math out of it, that's really layman's terms. Good. So you, you think... Being able to say, fuck you, AC, or whatever the fuck your name is, for holding me under for 16 years, don't even let it work for me in the United States, because we're going to change gold up, says the cops. Because we can't fuck a little uh, same position guy in the, in the relocations office of uh, uh, immigration, saying, we don't like to fuck immigration in Colombia, because we're too busy having a dick fight that we are calling our little Satan for fun in America, and you are interrupting. Yeah, I just lost my train of thought. I think Satan in Colombia thinks, I don't know why they aren't asking for me back. Why wouldn't they ask for me back? And you think the United States, you're going to win somehow with your Satan fucking... Your Satan is doing a belly flop and not getting hurt just about every time he gets in the pool. That's about how good America is treating Satan. Like, you'll even curve the fucking pot belly for uh, the water... So Satan won't get a belly flap. That's how good you are to Satan in America. But you won't even let me believe that. Because you need to be grounded and learn your lesson about reality. This is the kind of shit that I do need to start learning how to write down. Because I don't care who the fuck this man Tony Grindle thinks he is. He's no boss to me. He's a boss of only the people he can steal from. So if I'm working right now, somehow his damn fucking arg of a sailor pilot is on fucking going on steroids and stealing something from me that can't be returned. I guess I got a new name for him. It's Sailor Pirate. Why, you know what, I would like, if you're going to feed me for 20, you're going to actually lock me up in 46, save his skin that he's going to rip off, and we have better skin, so he can go into the, safe, however he's going to bury himself, I say jump into the uh, incinerator, I think Tony's actually going to have to jump in himself, that's kind of a scary thought, that video might not make it onto the internet very fast, but some people will see it. Now, am I going to have to hunt for this? I don't know. Somebody might show me that. Somebody might have the courtesy 
No, they're not, because they're, they're going to still rip me off somehow. Because apparently parental guidance is for everybody when you are a child of this adulterating family. So even in CA, in CA, they can say, you're still a dumbass, AC. Because we read that too. That makes you our higher power. We still have our higher powers. So eventually we're going to fuck you up the ass, CA. Because they want, because we definitely need to have him raped again. I don't know. Is this like reading the Bible? I was supposed to read the Bible seven times. Like that man has still never read the Bible. Like he's never read. He's watched Les Miserables on television. How was the money not important in Les Miserables? There's no money in Les Miserables on television. Oh, because we spent a whole lot fucking more than what Les Miserables was actually worth in the fucking book. Like, to a man that wrote, wrote Les Miserables, that's one of my pupils in my left eye now. Yeah, everybody goes into my right eye. You just can't fucking stand it. I get, you know how many people are in my right eye? And when I say take the lead out of my right eye, guess what, Jamie? You might have a little fun with me, thinking that's how many people just incidentally get into AC's world because he just they just do. Like the right eye, I, I thought I built a big enough door to keep you out. But Jamie, they're all, they could get in anyway. Like, you build in this, all, all this. What did the maids have to follow me the fuck home for? Like, I gave away a maid package. Like, did I do that at Hyatt or... You know, why, why is Best Western not complaining? Why is... Comfort Inn never complaining about how much money they got. Why are they not fucking complaining? This Best Western and Comfort Inn never complained about the fucking money in my account. But everybody else did complain about my fucking amount in my money's account. I had another point about that, but that was really important. Because the maids... I gave... A check me twice surrender to D magazine. <laughs> yeah, and I gave a maid because I got I got really tired at the Hyatt at the Omni. You know the uh, the Omni. Good Lord, where do you have sex with me? Well, how about you not talk to me about having sex with me and don't do anything to fucking me? Like, I wanted a mature maid. I told you what maids do with themselves all day long. It's my fault that the maid acted that way? Like, when did you actually find out about the maid? Bill King actually gives a shit about the maid? I mean, we're talking about Gas Monkey. What do I think about monkeys and gas? My stuff isn't gas. It's gasoline that I'm able to stay in this room for $2,400 a year. I owe American Express $2,400. I expect this room to stay together for that fucking much money. I don't know how we got from six weeks to a year. <laughs> I don't know.
You don't think a rider that has lost nerves in both of their fucking thumbs is a good fucking rider? Well, fuck you. I can't goddamn think anymore. I'm not even making sense to the fucking recorder. I have gone on to every single goddamn other subject almost every minute. I've written a fucking essay on my fucking phone before. Did you know I even told you in the fucking worded essay that I wrote an essay on speech to text? And I didn't have to fix that much. It was, a, it was like almost a normal fix, like if I had typed it with my eyes closed. Can I type with my eyes closed now? No! I cannot fix... I'm loud. Okay, far, far. Far out. We've got the planet back. Okay. We're going Mercury, Venus, Earth. I don't know. That's missing one. Venus is on the other side of Mars. Okay, Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Neptune. See, I'm missing a lot. Mercury, Earth, Venus. No. Mercury, Mars. Mercury, Mars, Earth, Venus. What's after Venus? Mercury, Mars, Earth, Venus. That's the first four. Uh, Saturn, Jupiter, Uranus, Neptune. That's eight. That's how many there are. You can almost say Platonics has to do with Plato. Does anybody even know what Plato did? I think he got the bus stop. You know, I really think Plato, what he's really important for is for the goddamn bus stop. Plato, Plato didn't care about fucking stop signs. You know, he really, I swear, Plato has nothing to fucking do with the octagon. If you asked Plato to get on the octagon, he would have said, please put a bus stop here and let me catch the bus. That's exactly what Plato would have done. That's a good fucking... I would I mean, Plato, on his fucking, right the, on the bench that we have in Dallas County, I swear, we have got Dallas bus, Plato's bus system in Dallas. We have the best freaking bus system in all of the United States. I think we should put Plato's birthday on one of those seats. Because he would sit there under any challenge and say, if there's not a bus stop here for me to catch the bus, I don't know what's wrong. Like, if there's some other Plato's, really, you got a cat named Plato, you can go out there and you can probably get a, there's work being done about your bus system. Where are you going to be when the bus system needs to be in place for you to do what you do? I don't know. I say leaving the country, there is an answer to that. I had so many answers to so many things. So many answers to so many things. Man. I really don't know what the sheriffs are doing. They are trying to erase me. Like, it's really annoying. If I was asked to be in jail right now and do the performance, that's who I need to be all the time with a good attitude. I'm good attitude. I was using good trouble. Yes, I was using good trouble for my good attitude because that's what everybody thinks I got. Now, if this man, Anthony Richard Grindle, victim, would stop criticizing me and filling the outside of my head with stuff that I can't think about anymore. I mean, it's literally making my head come out of itself 
So that there's nothing, there's not even a mushroom with all its spores. I mentioned this before I turned the recording on. That even the spores of thought that get spread so evenly and gracefully around the mushroom that was growing. For me to have my thoughts like a mushroom, apparently my thinking is like a mushroom according to my father. Like I might as well be a damn mushroom that can walk upstairs and walk down the stairs. I mean, I think a lot and somehow None of it is getting stuck in my head, and it's very dangerous. Like, how much of my 60 pages did I have? Maybe four. Four freaking pages handwritten on a small piece of paper. When I worked for Gent Magazine, I was writing a lot. Each article was... 2,000 words. Like we, you have to fill up a piece of paper, tiny words on a piece of paper. I mean, we, we honestly don't do that anymore. I see kids, and even myself, saying, oh, going up a notch in text size actually helps you out. Well, you know why? It's because I can't see through my glasses sometimes when I'm, I have perfect local vision for quite a, more of a distance now. I mean, where is that supposed to be on my glasses? It's supposed to be at the bottom. Like, I don't know. How do you even get to the bottom of my... If I'm reading, I have to read looking at the edge of my fingers. If I hold my fingers below me, that's the only place I can read. I mean, trifocals, good lord. I don't know what trifocals are supposed to do. And can I actually look at the top of my glasses for something that's far away? Now that's difficult. I just, I don't know what kind of trifocals I need. So anyway, we're going back. I just want to hit the point again that I'm changing my subject every minute now. That is my point. And I was supposed to hold in a whole bunch of information until I actually decided to write. Now in jail, I did it kind of. I studied some really great books, apparently. I don't know. Those books were excellent. Of course, Les Miserables is mis miserable. I couldn't even look at a lady and say pupa in my head to a lot of women. I must have become freaking sexy, like really sexy for the amount of money I just spent running around doing my shit even when they were saying pupa on the damn sidewalk corner I saw a woman on the sidewalk corner trying to say pupa to me and she, she grinned do you know she actually grinned saying that's my defense against a guy like you and I made her grin saying pupa to me that is definitely a reason to come home and put that on social media as fast as I could we got about four of these five speeds figured out of the bank Like how fast is the $1,700 going? I don't know. I didn't know I could walk out the door and you just say it's more and more and more. I have no idea where my papers are going. I can't get into my room without losing a piece of paper. Like I need somebody behind my back looking like a woman really looking at fending off Trojan zombies I call a zombie sex like being 16 years apart sex like I'm gonna use Biden I can have sex with Biden 
really. I'm going to use Biden and Harris as an example of what 16 year old apart having sex means. That is perfect example of what I call a Bidenism. I want to make a post now. I want to know where I should put that. Is there another locale for that? Let's go find the ultimate in fucking decal and do it right now.